the physicality of that still completely baffles me. With these specifications, you should be able to recreate several objects in the research and development lab adjacent to my office. This is one of the animals that Dolly cloned to rather, well, intriguing results. Thus was produced the world's first and only fully elastic dog. I named her Angstrom. You know, come to think of it, it reminds me of this toy from the 80s. Stretch, stretch something. Ah, you've moved on to a part of the manor where another type of dimensional rift is accessible. This is the Gravid Wolfram dimension, or heavy for short. This dimension is in direct opposition to the fluffy dimension and will make things ten times heavier. Now just imagine how long it took me to lay all that out. Be careful. I'd help you, but I've honestly forgotten which dolly is hooked up to which power converter.
some dimensions are tightly bound together, like the one we're in right now, and also the fluffy and heavy dimensions. That red battery will provide enough energy to enable the IDS device to widen the heavy dimension rifts in this area. It appears this dolly got stuck on an infinite loop. How unfortunate. There seems to be a large expanse of piles and pits filled with various random objects. No, not where you are. Here, in this confounded place. Are those hard candies? They're a little... fussy. Ugh. Fluffy. Nice job. No, not really. With the increased density and higher melting points of items in heavy dimension, quadrangle laser beams are rendered rather ineffectual. Like most things in life, timing is key. I came across Ike some time ago, and he decided to follow me back to the manor. I believe Ike stole these and hid them at one point. He's rather fond of shiny objects. Not half bad.
This was once the family cat, Lord Widget Pompadour Fluffington the Fourth, or Widget the First. Note that if you disrupt the blue beam, it should deactivate something. I'm not entirely sure how many BEDs of radiation that emits. Hope you're not looking to have children later. that. 